Do we need to start buying bulletproof vests pre-graduation? There's a lot, boy, there's a lot of folk out here getting dead after they graduate. Just saying. I seen another one out of here. I think this out of um, Jackson, Mississippi, if I'm not mistaken. Hey, 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 sugar. That baby has transitioned off earth. We got some video. We're going to go ahead on and get into it. Let you hear the story. This evening, a teenager is dead, gunned down at a convenience store just hours after her high school graduation. It's an absolutely heartbreaking story. 16 WAPT's Ross Adams live for us right now. And Ross, you spoke to her family today. That's right, we did. We're here at the gas station on Medgar Evers here. These bright red balloons mark the spot where Kennedy Hobbs lost her life. Her family is devastated. Tonight, they're demanding answers and action from police to stop what they call senseless violence. A Jackson teenager's promising life cut short after reaching a major milestone. And the loss of a young person, especially just after she's graduated, um, it's, it's, just, it's really tough. Kennedy Hobbs. Just hours after Kennedy Hobbs graduated from Murrah High School Tuesday, Jackson police say somebody shot and killed the 18-year-old outside a gas station on Medgar Evers Boulevard. According to social media posts, Hobbs was heading to her graduation party when she lost her life. My heart goes out to her immediate family, to her mom, to her family, um, to her friends, her, her fellow graduates. She had a bright future, had already started her own business as, as a young lady and graduated with honors. William Edwards is Hobbs' uncle. He says her dad drove two and a half hours to watch her graduate. We celebrated that both our kids graduated yesterday from Merle. Edwards says the family is devastated. I've never felt this way and uh, I'm trying to understand it but at this point it's hard to process. According to her family, Hobbs's boyfriend was also shot and killed at a convenience store. Police say somebody gunned down 21-year-old Jaquan Williams back in April on Rose Street and Robinson Street. It's unclear if the two shootings are connected. Why and how it transpired, I can't even get to that. But all I know is it's not right. Now, we have reached out to Jackson police to get information about how close they are to tracking down a suspect. One complicating factor could be that, that the surveillance video here at this convenience store was not working at the time of that shooting, so it apparently didn't capture what happened in the final moments of Kennedy Hobbs' life. Now, we should tell you that her family has a very strong connection to the Jackson Public Schools system. Her mom is a middle school teacher. She has a relative who previously served on the city school board. Live in West Jackson, Ross Adams, 16. Teacher is dead, gunned down. Oh, boy. Okay. All right. I know, I know, I normally watch 23689 as I always say out here, but, um, Hey, you still got to watch 23689. But that question that I had to ask in the beginning, do we have to start buying the graduates bulletproof vests? I understand we got to spend money on the cap and gowns and all that right there. But um, it's, it, 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 it's seeming to me that it might be more important that we give bulletproof vests out as graduation gifts. You never know what's the thing going to transpire. But let me, let me, let me, let me pour something else out to y'all. Let me. Let me go back to where they talked about the boyfriend. Celebrated that both our kids graduated yesterday from Merle. Edward says the family is devastated. I've never felt this way. And uh, oh, beautiful young lady, just beautiful, just so precious. Uh, I'm trying to understand it, but at this point, it's shout out to the uncle for um, the way that he's conducting himself in the interview. Hard to process. According to her family, Hobbs's boyfriend was also shot and killed at a convenience store. Let me tell y'all something. Something that's um is also happening down in Dade County, where I'm from. Um, people is getting shot and killed by mistake on purpose and shot due to association. 
because the people that you hang with or you hung with and people got problems with those people and you mess around and get shot. Now, I don't know why the boyfriend had done got shot. Don't nobody, well, I don't know what a player was all into or maybe he wasn't into nothing. Maybe he was just killed by mistake on purpose. You know what I'm saying? You never know, but association is something else. Now, I'm not even saying that because she had association with her boyfriend from last year that this is why. That ain't what I'm saying. I'm talking to you ones that's out here and you associate with people who is out here doing some dumb shit having problems with people, beefing with people, and don't think somebody else going to run up or see you whenever they see you. Parents. Parents. Shout out to her daddy for driving the two to two and a half hours to show up in support of his daughter. The sad part is the community knows who did what. I guess we still on this no snitch policy thing. Until it affects you, then you want somebody to talk. But I ain't going to say nothing because I'm scared that retaliation is going to happen, which retaliation is a real thing out here on earth. I'm just saying. They graduating, and they, 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 damn it, I'm going to do another story that's out of Miami too. A young baby done got killed out there at the after party of graduation. Just saying, y'all think this shit cute? Keep going with you. Loss of a young person, especially just after she's graduated, um, it's it's just, it's really tough. Kennedy Hobbs. A lot of us as parents have been sitting right out there in the crowd. Hell, I went to a graduation on Friday. We sitting out in the crowd, clapping this shit. We recording the guy, baby, all that. Shit. And to leave there and have your loved one killed. Just hours after Kennedy Hobbs graduated from Murrah High School Tuesday, Jackson police say somebody shot and killed the 18-year-old outside a gas station on Magra Evers Boulevard. According to social media posts, Hobbs was heading to her graduation party when she lost her life. She didn't even make it to the graduation party. She was on her way there. A situation at a gas station had then got her killed. Now I saw another video where um um um, I think they said it was about a parking spot or something. Just just a little simpler argument that could have been resoluted other than shooting somebody. But I guess they felt it was necessary to go and shoot somebody. Now I'm gonna say this here too now to all the females out there, because I don't know if she got shot by a female or shot by a player. Explain something to you. I'm not saying it is her. I'm just saying, a lot of times y'all mouth get y'all in a whole bunch of trouble. Because ain't nobody telling y'all to hush. I'm not saying it's a situation, but I know other situations to where if you were to hush and walk your little hot ass off, you wouldn't be dead that day. Just saying. I'm not saying it's her. I'm going to repeat I'm not saying that it's her. But this don't only go for the females, go for the males too. Our mouth, our mouth can make us leave earth early. Just trying to educate. Y'all be careful out there. And I, well, hell, you damn near got to say um, after graduation, sh- you might want to go out of town or something, man, just to be safe or something. You know, I don't, mm, you can't go, damn it, you can't be on your way to your parties, to your after parties. You can't be at the after parties. Oh, that's how they shoot in Dade County right now. His get caught at the after party. At the, sh- well, I tell you the truth. He's just shooting off in the crowd, just doing exactly what they want to do. Hell, but since y'all ain't going to tell, just keep recording and keep doing what you're doing to make sure that y'all upload the video so we can have something to say about it out here in these streets. And, um, if y'all still want to say in y'all same community and all that fly shit right there because you love your community, keep doing what you're doing. Just saying, excuse me, just saying. Watch 23689 to all you students. Watch 23689 if you want to live. Appreciate y'all for rocking. I'm out.